All right, hello everyone, I am back once again. And if you guys wanna get Roblox on a Raspberry Pi 5, this is the right video. Um, all right, so let me first start off from square one so you can, um, it's not, okay, there we go, shut down. Okay, let's shut down. Okay, and then now I need to uh, remove the micro SD card. Um, and if you guys have Raspberry Pi 5, I'm going to assume that you guys already have Raspberry Pi OS. Ooh, my toes. Anyways, you guys were not meant to see my toes, but it's okay. I don't really care. Anyways, so let's uh, have Raspberry Pi OS boot up. So uh, if you're like right here, okay, this is the first step. Um, what you want to do, shout out to Leap's videos, amazing YouTuber, very helpful. Um, right here, let's do, this is the video you need to watch. Right here. Right here, um, watch this video. This is how you get Android 14. So, just uh, follow that video. Um, make sure to use the right links. There are two links in the description. When you flat, uh, you probably won't get what I'm talking about yet, but when you watch the video, and when you flash the micro SD card, uh, when you, you know, when you like put the micro SD card in like the adapter and then, you know, go to Raspberry Pi imager and stuff, uh, make sure to use the Pi 5 link instead of the Pi 4 link, just so you don't get that mixed up. And make sure to um, go to my previous video, and I made some clarifications on this video uh, that do confirm uh, unclarified things in this video. And yeah, and then what you want to do after you install... Uh, Android 14, what you want to do, okay, let's switch back to Android 14. Uh, if you guys have any questions, uh, go to his video. Um, he usually replies most of the time. Uh, very active in the comments section. Uh, he's one of those rare YouTubers, in my opinion, that actually cares about his community. Okay, just let it boot up. I'm currently using the uh, um, Geek Pie Ice Tower Cooler. Amazing temps. Um, never goes over 50 degrees. Like, never. Even when I'm gaming on this thing. Or, like, coding or, like, intense game or whatever. Whatever I've done it with it so far, it's never gone above 50. Without the fan constantly running. So after that, you need to uh, have, um, later on in the video, we're gonna have to, um, excuse me. You're gonna have to mm, uh, verify your, hold on. Verify device ID Android. Okay, so you're gonna have to um, uh, verify your device ID because when you, um, after you um, get the Google Play Store on it, uh, it's gonna say it's unverified, you know. But don't panic, uh, it does work. There, um, what he does does work, and it's not like one of those like outdated videos. I just need to find the Google one. Google. Right here, confirm your identity using Android device. And check with your device manager. Hold on. Uh, is that right? True code? No, no, it's not it. This is not it. I need to go back. Go back.
Anyways, um, I can't find it right now, but because I think it's because I've already uh, verified. But anyways, let's remove this. This and that is Roblox. I'll show you guys that in a sec. Okay, please come on. All right, just press this. Okay. So I did get the Google Play Store to work. Everything works fine. Just search Roblox. Clash Royale does work. Um. Oh, I have to update it, too. Uh, I'll show you guys that in another video. Um, but I'm, I'm not really going to do that right after this one. So let me just show you guys Roblox for a sec. Because Roblox is the coolest thing to ever run on Raspberry Pi 5. I mean, there's really nothing else you can run on this thing. Just let it update. Uh... It's installing. Okay, it's done. So we're gonna exit. I'm gonna try it out. I've already signed it in everything. I usually the first time when it loads, it loads for a bit. Um Yeah, it made the screen may look big. It is not big. Um that's uh Yeah, it's not that big. This is my hand right here, like it's touching it right now. It's so not that big. This is like a really small, like this is my keyboard right here. And that's, that's the, the screen. Okay. So, uh, we can have like basic games running, uh, not too, you can't run big games on this thing. Uh, I did get Tower of Hell to run. And it runs great. Like this is like not what you expect from a Raspberry Pi. Like I don't think Raspberry Pi 4 can even perform this well. Like, it's not even that bad. It works too. It's just a bit of a delay. Um, yeah, it's just like a massive delay. I don't know what's up with that. See, like, if you guys want a comparison. See the delay? You guys can even see the camera too. Here. You guys can see, you guys saw that. Anyways, let me use the arrow keys. So, Leap's video used a controller, and I wasn't sure whether um, I wasn't sure whether keyboard would work or not, but it does, luckily. And let's see if we can just die for a sec. There you go, it works. Uh, I wanted to show you guys my graphic settings, too. Uh, it's at the lowest. And uh, the highest graphic settings, it does not perform that well. I'm just going to say that. Yeah, it's much worse. Anyways... We're gonna go back to settings and we're gonna lower back down. We're never gonna put that back up. Yeah, and uh, if we're trying running like like a basic base plate or something like basic games, that will run just fine. It's not gonna be running anything like 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 really graphic intensive or something. Uh, I'll, I'll probably try that like right after this game too. Uh, see you guys if you guys um, get a feel of. Oh, I just found. It. Okay, let's try it out right now. Hold up. Let's do something like Arsenal. Arsenal is pretty um, and, um, graphics intensive, at least for small devices or not very powerful devices. It is not running great. Let's see if we can adjust some settings to imp help improve this. We're gonna do part quality. We're gonna do low off. We're gonna do off on that one. Kill effects, shadows, all that off. Let's see. Mm, yeah, I think that's it. Exit and save. Okay, let's see. I am absolutely cracked at this game because I used to have a PC, but now I'm not. Okay, yeah, this is not playable. Don't ever play FPS games on a Raspberry Pi 5.
This is let me see if I can get a kill actually. Hold up. Let me see if I can get a kill. I can't really hold on to my phone right now. How do I do this? I have no idea. Let me try using this other keyboard that my sister has. Sorry guys, I cannot do this. Okay, there we go. Okay, I have a thumb. I have my thumb on it. Actually, I don't even need this keyboard. Okay, here, I have my thumb on it. Okay, let's see if we can get a kill. I. That'd be hilarious if I did. Okay, we're gonna. We're not even gonna jump here. We're just gonna keep going. One kill would be hilarious. I think that'd be worth the laugh. Oh shoot, yeah, I don't think I am gonna get a kill. Maybe an assist, an assist. Let's follow these guys, let me follow these guys. Looks like I could probably get a kill out of them. Why is my mouse not moving? My mouse is not moving this way. Why is my mouse not moving this way, okay. It only moves to the right, or to the, oh, oh, okay. Free kill, guys. If I mess this up. Okay, good thing I didn't mess that up. If I did, that would be even more hilarious. Uh, let's just keep going till we die. Uh, oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god, I'm actually... This is crazy. Okay, well... Anyways, uh, not playable. Not fun. Don't ever do this. Okay, let's try a different game. Let's try base... Let's try base blade. See, uh, uh, the most basic game you can ever get. I like to use this. Okay, there's a lot of people here. Uh, what is going on? What in the world is going on? Why in the world is that happening? I think this game's hacked. Anyways. Oh, no. I think it's just my graphic settings, actually. It could be just my graphic settings. No, that's not my graphic settings. My bad. Nope, not my graphic settings. Okay, well, that's just happening. But it runs well. Um, yeah. And I think that's it. Um, just wanted to show you guys Roblox. It's... I mean, it's really the only reason why I got this thing. Um, it's really fun. Uh, I mean, if you, if you, you just ask your parents, hey, I want a Raspberry Pi 5 for Christmas or something, or my birthday or something, and you can just ru have Roblox running and just have like, you could even have like a secret, like a secret gaming setup. Well, not really a gaming setup, but like a secret setup, like in your bed or something. And have like this, this tiny monitor, and you can like hook up your controller to it. And you just play at night. It should be pretty cool. Um. Anyways, I think that's it for today. I'll see you guys on the next one.